Mystery box unboxings full of video games. Now one of these, I think, will have something that will make my childhood dreams come true. Let's start with this box right here. Now I can't really remember what's inside of the other, these big three boxes. Uh, I make a lot of deals, buy a lot of collections with viewers that email me at caterpiecrew.com. They'll send me an email or reach out through Instagram or Facebook. Those are the best three ways. And usually the people that reach out to me with a list and pictures and an asking price are the ones that I make deals with. So pretty sure that's what happened here. Um, this one is from Mike. So shout out to Mike. He left his PayPal email. This is a $440 deal. That's all I really need. Details of the deal, your name, how you contacted is the main thing. And I think this is going to be a GameCube bundle, brother Dave. Oh boy. A GameCube bundle. Okay, so we're starting out with Wii, which Animal Crossing and two Wii Sports Resorts. This is my number one demanded game. And we'll, uh, we'll repost the buy list in the description. So I have certain things that I buy all the time for fixed prices, and the, they're on that buy list. Consoles, and then bundler games especially, like Wii Sports Resort, Wii Sports, Mario Kart, things like that. Um, and then if it's just a collection buy, you can just reach out and we'll work something out. But then we got GameCube. Let's, wait, there's still a little more Wii. We're saving the GameCube for last year. Mario All-Stars, that's nice. Mario Kart, like I said. Mario Party 8. Mario, Mario Super Sluggers, all A-tier, first party Wii games. Let's see what we got for GameCube. Oh, there we go. Zelda, Collector's Edition, Luigi's Mansion, and Pac-Man Fever. So let's see how the condition on this disc is. Actually really good. Usually like GameCube games that are loose are in terrible condition. That one's not great, but I think it'll still play. We'll probably have to resurface it, make sure it's fully working. All right, more GameCube games here in the cases. We've got WrestleMania XA, NBA Live 04, Naruto, Top Gun, Final Fantasy, Crystal Chronicles with some crispy cover art. <laughs> <laughs> Very crispy. The manual's good, though. WrestleMania there. And then one of my favorite games. And another one of my favorite games. Oh, boy. Melee and Sunshine. Are they complete? Yes. And yes. Nice. That's what I like to see right there. Some of Brother Dave's favorite games. Oh, well. yeah. All right, Tetris Worlds. There's another one, Mario Kart there Double Dash. That is complete. Metroid Prime. That's a good one right Star there. Star Wars The Clone Wars. Marvel ne Nemesis, also a crispy cover art on that one. Water damaged. And then Soul Calibur 2, featuring... Mr. Link. Link. GameCube, console, controller, and cables, and then a couple PSP games to bring us home. Right there, so $440 was the deal that we agreed to. I just have to verify the contents, make sure the GameCube works, make sure the games are good to go. It's looking good. So that one is settled. I'll put the note right on top so we can get to that. And then this one. This is from Carlos. And it says fragile all over it. It's got eBay tape on it. Was this an eBay thing? I don't think so. Oh, this is from Mexicano Lobo. That's his username on whatnot, and he is awesome. <laughs> He's awesome. Let's go. So I bought. Mexicano Lobo. Yes. Thank you. He was dancing and his whatnot. You gotta follow him on whatnot if you don't. He was. He's great. He was hilarious. But it's a Last of Us PS3. Oh, nice. Timely. Yeah. Uh, there's something else here. I don't know if this was part of it or what. Oh yeah. Sends Mexican candy with everyone. Oh, wow. <laughs> what a guy. A whole bunch of it, too. Look at that. <laughs> That's fun. I like it. We got to step up our game. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so that is that. Let's do this this small one next. And then we'll do the big one and then the childhood dream one. Hopefully that's what it is. If not, <laughs> I'm going to look silly. You never know. <laughs> <laughs> and I think this is a, a whatnot purchase. Maybe? Let's see. It is. Just a random stream I went to. Super Mario World was like 10 bucks, and I said, oh, Why not? Right. Yeah. <laughs> Gotta have it. One of the greatest games of all time for 10 bucks. Cash. Okay, nice this, this one's heavy. This is like probably like 75 pounds. But to the brother Dave, it might feel like 10. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I think it's like 25 pounds. <laughs> oh, <God>. <laughs> <laughs> this one, who's this from? It's from D. <laughs> Don't have a full name. In Jonesboro, Tennessee. 
Wii U. Wii, GameCube games. So that's 250 to 270. So we've got a PayPal email on there. I can't remember why it's a 250 to 270 range. I'll have to look back at, at the email. We got a bunch of manuals here. Wii Sports Resort, Mario Kart, Mario Galaxy. I don't know if those are extra, if they're if they're part of it. We shall see. Everything is bagged up, so we're gonna get this all out of the bags and we'll show you guys after we get it out. So we decided to lay out the biggest box of the deal. Now this one, we'll call it $270. Right here's everything. So we got a Wii U, all cords, a GameCube, a little bit of yellowing there on the front, um, a Wii. I uh, love these remotes, the Peach and the Mario. We got manuals and stuff for some of the games, which are back here. Some of the highlights are Mario Kart 8 on top, uh, New Super Mario slash Luigi, one of the best values on Wii U, great game in Donkey Kong, Mario Strikers, Mario 3D World, Pocket Tournament, Mario Kart 8 again, Mario Party 10, and then Smash on the bottom. Uh, plus two extra Wii remotes right here. So 270 bucks on this one. Right here was $440. We'll call that collection two. This is collection one. Which one do you think we did better on? I'd be curious to see which one you'd rather have. More software heavy over here, more hardware heavy over here. But now we're gonna finish out with the most expensive package. Sometimes the best things come in small packages. And this was a whatnot buy from one of my favorite uh, sports card YouTubers. Card Collector 2. So Ryan is doing a stream, had some good deals in the buy it now section, and I made some offers. Actually, every single one of these cards was a, was a card I would have dreamed of as a kid. There's three. They're all graded, and I got a good deal on them. So the first one, for those that don't know, I played tennis in high school, and I really loved it, all four years. So Roger Federer, rookie card, Net Pro PSA 10. So it's Net Pro Elite 2000 PSA 10. That's a sweet card. And then right behind it, another one. And this one I remember, Net Pro Glossy from when I was a kid. I think I got each of these for like 100 bucks below comps. This one's actually limited to, to 2,000. So that's, a, that's really cool. And then the one behind it is the best. Let me see if I can get what I paid for these. So I paid $400 for one of the Federers and 450 for the other. And they're both worth about 550 to 600. And then this. I paid 700 for this. That's a PSA 4 Nolan Ryan rookie card. Which blows my mind. He's one of the greatest of all time as far as pitchers go. Some would put him as the greatest. Pitched for like over 20 years. He was pitching all the way. Man, he pitched so long. Um, up into the 80s. And this is a 1968 Topps Nolan Ryan rookie card. You gotta love it. I paid 700 bucks for it. It's worth about 800, so it was a good solid deal. And it's one that will go in my collection. All three of these will go in my collection. Childhood dreams do come true. And hopefully we can get them properly displayed soon. So be on the lookout for a collection tour down the line of the games and the cards. Hit the like button if you made it this far. This was a fun mystery box opening. What will do? What? <laughs> spicy Laffy Taffy. Spicy Laffy Taffy? Find out in a, in a couple hours. <laughs>